Hello everybody. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Now, I had gotten a request from, uh, from someone uh, wanting me to display the recipes on some of my videos. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to tell you how to make the Portuguese mashed potatoes. Okay. On the Portuguese mashed potatoes, when you make that, you need to peel the potatoes first. If you want to, you can use about five or six potatoes, depending how much you want to make. Um, peel the potatoes first. Next step, you need to cut it up into bite-sized pieces. The smaller you make it, the faster it'll cook. Once you get all the potatoes all chopped up, put it into a pot with enough water covering all the potatoes. Then you boil the potatoes until it's soft enough where you can stick a fork through. Once you can stick a fork through without forcing a fork, the metal fork, um, then the potatoes are ready. Take the potatoes out of the pot, drain the water, then the next thing you need to do is take a plastic bowl, put the potatoes in there, and use a potato masher, or if you don't have any of those potato mashers, um, you could use a wooden wooden paddle, uh, spoon, or even a rice paddle, um, and you'll have to continuously mash the potatoes till it's in mashed potato form. Then the next thing you'll need to do um, is in the Portuguese mashed potatoes we add um, codfish. Now when we add the codfish in Hawaii we use the salted codfish. Now our Portuguese mashed potato that we make we call it fugot, okay? As Portuguese mashed potatoes, and they have a different name that's on my video in, in Portuguese, okay? Pure de pata, okay? So, once you mash the potatoes in a bowl after draining, um, you're gonna want to um, make sure if you use codfish, make sure it's defrost, uh, defrosted then you're gonna to have to shred the codfish. If you're using the unsalted codfish, then you'll have to add a little salt to the codfish. Don't add too much salt, just enough salt where you can have the salt flavor. Then the next thing, once you mash it, you're gonna to have to put that into the potatoes and mix all that together in the uh, Portuguese fugard mashed potatoes. Then, the next ingredient that you need to put into the Portuguese mashed potato, or we call fugard, or pure de pata, is um, you're gonna have to chop some green onions. Once you chop the green onions, um, put that into the Portu uh, Portuguese mashed potatoes, or we call fugard. Put that in there, mix all it together, make sure you have enough salt in the potatoes in the mixture so you could taste the salt, the potato, and the codfish. It gives a unique flavor. So, <clears throat> I hope you enjoyed this video and uh, if you like to make the uh, Portuguese uh, cod, uh, mashed potato, or we call fugard or pie de pata, um, that's how you make it. All right, so, you're welcome to like, subscribe, and um, if I can find a way to um, um, display the recipe so you, you know so you can see it. Uh, but until then, um, I thought I'd do this um, video and tell you how to make it. If you um, if you watch the video, there's some music on there, and you can't really hear my voice too much. So my, my uh, daughter had uh, commented on me, so that's why I am doing this uh, 
this video and telling you how to make this um, mashed potatoes. So you watch the video, you can see how to do it. All right, so I just thought I'd give you a little uh, video um, narration on how to make the Portuguese uh, fugard mashed potatoes. All right, don't forget to subscribe. You can like and share and drop me a comment. Okay, all right, you take care. This is Tony D from Hawaii in Galveston, Texas on the island here. You take care, aloha.